Welcome to the piano studio of Lisa Bailey. We are in Carol Matz's favorite solos, book one, page 12 and 13, The Alien in My Tree House. Ooh, that sounds very interesting to have an alien in your tree house. I'm going to play through this piece. So this is on page 12, 13, and 14. So here's another one that's three pages. So I have my page folded so I can turn it. I'm going to play through this piece and then we will talk about a few things in the piece. It is thumb sharing C again. So we're back to our familiar location. And we have some sharps in this piece. So you'll see a sharp right here in the very first full measure. So this is called measure one. Even though we have an incomplete measure here, a little measure, remember when we have an incomplete measure, the other beats are at the end of the song. So this note right here, this measure does not count as a full first measure. It is this measure that counts as measure one. So in measure one, we have a sharp. We have another one over here. And then take a look at this. We have a D sharp here, but then there's no sharp next to this D here. So sometimes it will be sharp and sometimes it won't be sharp. So you're gonna wanna watch that. Um, let's see what else there is. We have some cool dynamics all the way through. We start off with mezzo forte. So usually about a medium volume as you play through, but then we get quiet over here in measure 25. We have piano over here. And the words, listen to the words, keep this just between us. I didn't care for Venus. So it's like you're whispering and you're not wanting the alien to hear what you're talking about. Uh, and then we have this crescendo, this great big alligator mouth memes to gradually get louder until your mezzo forte and then your mezzo forte all the way to the end. Oh, no, you're not. I missed one. Forte right here. So you want a mezzo forte here and then you're going to get loud for the ending here. I almost missed that one. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to my channel. I always enjoy hearing from people who watch my videos and have learned something new. So please leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Thanks so much. I'll see you in the next video.